ATF of facts and fallacies about foreclosure in San Diego, CA and San Diego County. There are many misunderstandings concerning the issue of foreclosure in San Diego, CA and San Diego County. Unfortunately these misconceptions have led many homeowners in San Diego to take all the wrong actions in trying to stop the California state foreclosure process, which ultimately caused them to lose their homes. Below are a few of the myths that seem to persist regarding bank foreclosures. The bank wants your San Diego County home so they can resell it. Nothing could be further from the truth. The bank almost never wants your house. They want the money you owe along with interest. Typically banks usually have going through the foreclosure process and will bend over backwards to work with homeowners in avoiding a foreclosure. The bank won't accept my payments. I'm all out of options. The bank wants you to bring your payments current. Period. Remember they are in the money business. The interest on your loan is their life lot. All is not lost however. If this isn't practical for you then a mortgage negotiation professional can set up a plan for you to pay just a portion of the arrears, set a plan to pay future current payments and catch up on the remaining arrears over time. The foreclosure notice was delivered today. I have to start packing. Depending on your lender, you may have a very long foreclosure process. This may give you several months, if not longer to move. Remember that you have to find a new place to live because eventually you will be physically removed. I'm in foreclosure, someone in San Diego, CA will help me with a refinance. Since the subprime mortgage meltdown lenders are in the Euro T touching borrowers who are behind on their mortgage payments, no matter how much equity is in their San Diego County home. I'll just file bankruptcy and save the house. For starters this isn't as easy as it once was. Bankruptcy laws are getting tighter and deliberately more difficult. A Chapter 7 bankruptcy will stop the home foreclosure on it temporarily. The caveat is you need to do something else to keep the house in the long run if you are facing foreclosure in San Diego County. The bank has our house so we can wash our hands of the whole affair. This assumption has come back to haunt many people. If there is a deficiency you may still owe the difference plus any interest even though you no longer own the home. I pulled off a minor miracle and got all the money I owe the bank to bring me current but I'm afraid it's too late to stop the foreclosure process. Wrong. In California state if you have all of the money you owe the bank they have to take it and stop the foreclosure. It is the law and besides the bank doesn't really want the house back in the first place. They get to keep all my stuff once they take my home. The rule of thumb here is if you can carry it away it's yours. You keep your personal property but permanent attachments to the house should stay. Don't a Euro T turn it into an issue by taking everything from floor to ceiling. That will just ensure trouble. The bank started this process. They can't expect me to pay legal fees. They do and you will if you want to keep the house. The amount will vary depending on what is contained in your mortgage agreement. There's nobody in San Diego to help me stop my home foreclosure unless you have more help at your fingertips than you might imagine. Many methods and many professionals can help you avoid foreclosure in San Diego County. These are a few of the rumors out there involving foreclosure. The best advice is to contact a foreclosure prevention specialist in San Diego or anywhere else in San Diego County and allow them to handle the process.